Okay, in this video I'll show you how to set up uh, MIDI triggers using the BCF2000 that is built into the software. Uh, this also pretty much applies to the exact same way for um, if you have the actual BCF2000 hooked up to your computer at the same time. So you really just simply need to kind of move the fader up a little bit. Uh, select your scene. Right click on the fader. Hold control. Go up to new command, uh, go to button, to button activation, it didn't work. You'll see button activation, sign spot 300D, button CMY on and off. So, I mean, you can even uh, change the level if you know how to do that. Um, I'm not really too fluent with MIDI, so this is just the basics uh, for me. Select OK. So now if you hit INIT, then click on this fader, CMI will play. If you, say, go to drumming, click on this, click on drumming once more. Right click, hold control, click on add new command, go to button, button activation, and there's your scene, click OK. So now you can just simply go between the two, and you know, you can also assign scenes to any of these buttons up here. Uh, you may be able to assign, may be able to assign multiple scenes to a pot. I'm not too sure about that. I know I've done it before. I can't remember how. Uh, like I said, my MIDI knowledge is very, very basic. Very limited. Uh, but I do know that you can trigger basic scenes from the BCF uh, <clears throat> in CompuLive, just like I just showed you. Uh, to get rid of a, uh, a command, right-click on the fader. Select your command, hit this red X, delete, hit OK. So now there's nothing on this fader anymore. Now you can do the same over here. Select your command, delete, OK. So, I mean, while basic, you know, it still works. Uh, you know, you're, you can also assign the, the dimmer fader of a scene to one of these faders, and it will control the, the dimming for that scene it'll turn it on then you can adjust dimming you can also do speed faders for if you have a, a scene with the easy step or easy time uh, or I think it's just easy time so that's how you do that so I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video and uh, let me know if you have any questions thank you